And running football is a complete waste of time. It's so boring. It lasts for hours. It doesn't deserve to be called a sport. If you're a die-hard football fan like Freddy here, you may not have too much love for America's favourite game. Although I may know a few people who will disagree with him. You will love it. It's an incredible game to watch. You get drawn into it. There are such strong characters in the game. I think it's just something different. I think it attracts people of all um, sizes, shapes, all fitness levels. And it's just an excellent sport. It's a thing where people can sit together and enjoy. You can cheer for your team and I can cheer for mine and we can have a good time doing it. American football, or NFL as it is widely known, has recently seen a rise in popularity in the UK. Three consecutive sellout games at Wembley Stadium have proved that the UK fan base of the game is growing. Natalie Pinkham, who presents NFL UK on Channel 5, welcomes the American sport. There are big cultural differences between our country and theirs, but that should be celebrated, not shunned. You know, you should embrace that and actually enjoy it for what it is. It's a little slice of America. Meanwhile, Sky's NFL expert, Kevin Cadle, praises the game's entertainment factor. It's an event, you know, it's just not sports, it's an event. The whole thing of it is to make sure that, you know, when you leave that you have more than just going to a sporting occasion, that you've gone to a sporting event. Growth in the game has also seen grassroots NFL teams spring up in the UK. America-born Tim Illes has decided to revive one such franchise. There was a team called Bournemouth Bobcats. They ceased to operate in the early 90s and they had an excellent reputation and a good following. So I thought, why not use their name and try and recreate a team? But how have the Bobcats been getting on? It's going a lot better than I first expected. We seem to be building each week. Hopefully from there we're going to kind of build on to um, be a, a proper association team. So with more and more fans each year, it looks like NFL has touched down in the UK.